Welcome back to Site Tech Intermountain SiteWorks training videos. In this quick tip today, I'm going to show you how to, on the fly, change the radio channel frequency that you've picked with your data collector without having to drop the data collector and go back through it. What I mean by that is if you're already hooked up to a base, in the top right corner you got a look cell tower looking icon. If you hit that, it'll tell you the radio information. It'll say, hey, I'm connected to network 10 and it'll give you the base name, WMCSLC, and it's a one second reception on my latency. If you want to change that, a lot of people go into the menu, they go to project setup, and they go to connect device, and they drop the connection in order to change the channel if they needed to. But a quick way to do it is just go back into that cell tower looking icon, and just go ahead and hit change channel right there. And I can go from a base 10 in the area to a base 11, It'll do the same setup where it's uh, looking for corrections, waiting for the new base info once it actually finds that base, and then it'll tell me that I have a new base. Once it's found it, it'll say new base is being used, and then you can verify here on this same screen if you stay there that yes, I'm on channel 11 now, and that base name there, CREF0001, and I have a one second reception. So that's how you can quickly change between base frequencies without actually dropping the receiver and having to reconnect to it again. So thanks for watching this quick tip from Site Tech Intermountain, SiteWorks training videos.